Hi, I'm Lynn Hunsaker with Clear Action. Whatever your role is, you rely on everyone in your firm to be in sync. First of all, with customers, and secondly, with one another. When you're in sync, everything good is stronger. You have a lot less waste and a lot more value generated for everyone. So how do you influence that as a leader? When I led company-wide customer experience, I was brought into a situation where the CEO of our largest customer said, you're really arrogant and hard to do business with. That probably applies to most companies and governments and nonprofits. We all have a lot of pride, a lot of ambition for what we stand for, and yet, Things are unnecessarily hard for customers and employees and partners, and we rely on all three of those to make everything work. So the first key of influence is curiosity. How much do you know about all the different organizations in your company? You're the keeper of a lot of insights, customer insights, partner insights, employee insights. What's the utilization rate of those insights? So how I started was I got to know every different group, um, paying attention to what they did, asking questions, and also looking at what our customers were saying. How did that apply to different groups? Which groups were contributing to what customers were saying, good and bad? What was needed to what was needed by all the different groups so that they weren't flying blind, unnecessarily throwing things over the fence, and being more informed about how they could be creating greater value. So when I was curious about others and curious about customers, that was contagious. People became became curious about what's happening with customers now. And what a golden moment that was in the spring of 2020. If you remember April, May, June, everybody, without exception, was wondering, what's going on with our customers? How can we help? What do we need to change to keep our customers happy and buying from us? Well, that was a golden moment that we want to rekindle under positive circumstances going forward. Let's help everyone be curious. So to do that, we need to get beyond data sharing and look for patterns. That means intelligence sharing. So start with yourself. Find out more about every organization. Find out about who the leaders are. What are their personal and cor uh, career uh, corporate uh, goals? And hot buttons, what are their pressures? What are the risks? What kind of timing pressure do they have? When you start to know your internal customers as well as you know your external customers, you can create influence. Also be looking for patterns in your data. Go beyond just regular charts that your dashboard has to look deeper. When something happens, customers are likely three times more likely to do X or whatever. Use data mining, use uh, artificial intelligence and so on, predictive analytics, multivariate analysis to put more interest into employee experience insights, partner experience insights, and customer experience insights. So this is the first of a weekly series about influencing that you're going to see in this vlog for ease of business and ease of work. Because curiosity is the key to keeping things fresh, staying ahead of your competition, and being agile as an organization, first to market with the right messaging, the right response, the right products, and so on, so that you can be a leader and continually grow and make our life better for everyone in the world because everyone's a customer.